I apologize in advance. Like I said, it's the first batch. The next one is on the way. Again, I hope I can get my hands on those too so I can show y'all the updated version. What it do, what it do, what's going on YouTube? This your boy DIY Kari coming back to y'all with another video. Today we got a very, very special shoe that releases next year. Not next year. I don't even know why I'm saying that. Next month. Next month, right before Christmas. Everybody usually be looking forward to these, but I don't know the vibe on these this year. Honestly, haven't really heard much talk about them but we got the first iteration in hand right off the bat this is the first iteration so i'm gonna keep that i'm gonna keep saying that throughout the video because it is not the final product from this company but before we get into it make sure y'all like comment subscribe to the channel hit that bell notification Follow your boy on Instagram at DIY Kari. I will have the information right here and in the description below so y'all can follow me there because I do release these images or video clips on there first. So we're going to get it straight into it. Y'all already know. And if you don't, this whole channel is based on UA shoes fake shoes reps however y'all want to say it that is what i review on a daily upload or every every week at least three videos been a little slow right now because i don't work from home no more so i don't have too much time to get them not but we're gonna get this one out straight to y'all again this is the ua shoe it is not the final product from this company and the company we are talking about today is going to be four foot all the information will be in the description below for them just keep in mind this is the first iteration it is not the final product so it does not look like the actual shoe but the shoe we are talking about today is going to be the retro 11 velvet threads again this is not the final product y'all because if you've seen images, the whole shoe should have velvet, but the upper is gonna be suede on this one. That is not correct. I already reached out to them, let them know that it should be different. So they already in the works with the new update. But the bottom is straight. You got the iridescent in red insole outsole i mean you can see the jordan in the middle this is not correct this is not correct that should be a darker carbon fiber that is more so white with black dots the jordan should be more burgundy that is clearly red and I'm not trying to call them out on their product but I have to be straight transparent with my subscribers with y'all I don't want y'all to order the shoe and then come back to me and it's like no it don't look like the shoe I don't want y'all doing that so that that is why I'm letting y'all know this is not the final product does have the tag in the inside comes with paper go ahead and show you the other one that is going to be the other one everything else is correct other than not being full velvet the jordan should be darker and it should be metal it's not metal it has Jordan right here. That's correct. The white midsole, that is correct. 
So it's not all bad. Just not, not on point. This is gonna be an insole with a Nike Air. Not sure if that's correct. I have not seen other videos on it yet. So can't say if that's wrong or right. But just wanna let y'all know how they look for the first batch. And it will be better and it will be on point the second batch. Hoping I can get that second batch from them so I can show y'all how they look and how on point they are. I will be reaching back out to them to see when that one's gonna be done so I can get back to y'all. But this is, again, the first iteration, not the final, not the last, of the Velvet Breads Retro 11s that release next month in December. This is gonna be a women's size eight. This is what came in the box and it has the supposed to be carbon fiber. That's the box again. Yeah, let me know what y'all think of the first batch from four foot. I apologize in advance. Like I said, it's the first batch. The next one is on the way. Again, I hope I can get my hands on those two so I can show y'all the updated version. But that is all I have. This is going to be your boy, DIY Car. Thanks for coming back. Thanks for watching. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and follow your boy on Instagram, DIY Car. Everything is in the description below. Peace out.